This video will cover the topic, Vertical Line Test. Graphs consist of sets of points that correspond to ordered pairs in the form of x, y. A graph represents a function if no two points have the same x-coordinate. Okay, so if a graph contained the points 2, 5 and 2, negative 3, it wouldn't be a function? Correct. Let's take a look at a graph and use the vertical line test to determine if it is representative of a function. If we can draw a vertical line that intersects the graph more than once, then the graph fails the vertical line test, and it is not a function. If it is impossible to draw a vertical line that intersects the graph, this means that each x value is independent and it is a function. This graph fails the vertical line test. We can draw a line that intersects the graph more than once, so it does not represent a function. This second graph also fails the vertical line test. We can draw a vertical line that intersects the graph twice, so it is not a function. This third graph is a function. It passes the vertical line test because it is impossible to draw a vertical line that intersects the graph more than once. Let's take a look at this fourth graph. This graph would not be a function because it fails the vertical line test by intersecting the graph twice. In the future, I can test if a graph is a function by using the vertical line test, because this would mean two points have the same x value. Great job! Now it's your turn. 